and welcome to our Tiny Tot Worship. We're so happy that you've joined us. And you know what? Jesus is happy that you've joined us too. It makes Jesus so happy when we take the time to spend with him. And today, boys and girls, our special guest is all the way from Cuba, Cuba. Mrs. Esmeralda Guzman. Welcome, Mrs. Esmeralda. Welcome. Well, thank you, boys and girls. I'm so happy to be here. Do you know what Cuba is? Do you know? No. Well, pretend that this is the United States, and then Cuba is a tiny little island right here, right below Florida. That's where Cuba is. <gasps> That's a long ways, isn't it, boys and girls? Yeah. Well, we're so happy that you came all the way to be on Tiny Me Tots too. with us. And today, boys and girls, we're talking about Jesus wants us to do our best. And we have a memory verse that goes with that. And learn it with us, okay? I'll say it first, and then you all say it after me, okay? Ecclesiastes 9, 10. Ecclesiastes 9, 10. Whatever your hand finds to do. Whatever your hand finds to do. Do it with all your might. Do it with all your might. Now, I happen to know that Miss Esmeralda has a story that's going to explain our Bible verse to you, and you're not going to want to miss it, boys and girls. But first, let's start with prayer. Ben, could you have a prayer and invite Jesus to be with us? Sure. Okay, boys and girls, close your eyes and bow your head. Dear Jesus, please be with us in our worship. I love you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Well, boys and girls, I'm thinking of a song that I'd like to sing. See if you can guess it. It's about one man didn't do his best for Jesus, and one man did his best for Jesus. What song is that? The foolish man built his house upon the sand. Yeah! Sing it with us, boys and girls. The foolish man built his house upon the sand. The foolish man built his house upon the sand. The foolish man built his house upon the sand. And the rains came tumbling down. The rains came down and the floods came up. The rains came down and the floods came up. The rains came down and the floods came up. And the house on the sand went flat. But what happened when the wise man built his um, house? He did his best for Jesus. Let's sing that verse. The wise man built his house upon the rock. The wise man built his house upon the rock. The wise man built his house upon the rock. And the rains came tumbling down. The rains came down and the floods came up. The rains came down and the floods came up. The rains came down and the floods came up. And the house on the rock stood firm. So we should do our best for Jesus, shouldn't we? Yeah. yeah. Well, Miss Esmeralda, before your story, we have a surprise for you. Wow. Luke and Jasmine are going to play their violins for you. And you know what's special? Luke and Jasmine are twins. Mm. Oh, is that special, boys and girls?
Very that good. Was Aren't they doing good? Beautiful. Uh, and they play so beautifully together. Yes, they do. Okay, boys and girls, that who's ready great. for a story? Me. Okay. I'm so happy to be here, and I want to tell you a story about the time that I was a little girl. I was six years old. Is anybody here the six years old? I was Nicole your age, is. yes, and I wanted to learn how to play the piano. I was so thrilled to listen to you guys. You, you are so good playing the violins. I wanted to learn how to play the piano. And I begged my mommy, I said, I want to learn how to play the piano. And my parents, we were living in Cuba, in Cuba in Spanish. And my mom was so hard. She has to uh, wash all the people's clothes and impress them to make money to buy me a piano. And I wanted to have a piano so bad, so bad, so bad. And in my country, a lot of people were very poor. So we didn't have a way to buy a piano. But my parents were saving a little bit of money at a time. And one day, my mom told me, guess what? We're going to get a piano. <gasps> I was so happy to get a piano. So we finally got the piano. And I remember that I sat on the piano. How do you think I'd sound like? Do you want me to tell you how it sound like? Let's go to the piano. Come on. Oh, come on. Let's go, Let's to, the go to the piano. Okay. This is how I used to sound when I when I started to play the piano. And I thought I was playing the piano. Did I play the piano like that? No. No. And then my mom said, you have to practice. But guess what? I didn't want to practice. I just wanted to play the piano. And I was playing the piano. And my mother said, you have to practice. But I wanted to play with my friends. Didn't you want to play with your friends instead yeah. of practicing yeah. violin? Yeah. Yeah. I wanted to play with my friends. And my mother said, you have to play the piano. And you know what? I got a lot of whooping for not wanting oh. to practice. And then when my friends were playing, I was practicing the piano. And I have to do this. And I couldn't get my fingers together. And it was so hard. And I was crying and crying because I didn't want to play the piano. And then my mom did this. She would sat me down and she said, you know why I want you to practice piano? because I want you to be the best. And when, when you want to be the best, you have to study. You have to practice. Because if you don't practice, then you won't be able to play. So I used to practice then like this. And then when I was practicing, practicing, practicing again, then I would do this. And then when I practice some more, I could do this. And then one day I went to a recital. How many of you have gone to a recital? What is a recital? It's when you play your instrument. Right in front of other people. And I was playing in front of other people and I remember I was playing like this. But then I was growing and I was practicing more and more and then I started to play like this. Do you know this song? Let's sing it together. Plays a piano. I know somebody play piano. Come on. <laughs> okay, we're gonna play together. Okay, you play there, I play here. Is that good? Okay, okay, go. what happened? I grew and I grew. Well, I didn't grow because you see that I'm very short, but uh, I'm 53 years old. That's a lot of years.
And you know what happens now? I go places and I can play the piano. If I wouldn't pay attention to my mom when she made me practice, I couldn't do the things that I do now. That's why it's so important when mommy tells you, you need to practice the violin or you need to practice the piano or you need to fix your room or you need to do your homework. You have to try your best because one day you're gonna be a doctor, you're gonna be uh, a lawyer, and you're gonna be another doctor or a teacher, and you're gonna be a concert pianist. You know why? Because you did your very best. And that's what we have to do. And Jesus wants us to do our best. Exactly. That's what our, that's what our Bible verse means. Miss Cynthia, do we have time for Ben to play something? Yes, why don't you Good. play a song with him? Yes, come on, you, I really want to hear him okay, play. Okay, Ben. So the other boys and girls, they can also know the little play kids the can song also you were practicing play, right? for me. I would love to. Okay, I'm going to stand. I'll fly away. Yes. Do that one. Thank you so much for being with us. You know, let's go and just say our prayer. Let's sing our prayer song and let's have a prayer and thank Jesus for being with us. And Nicole, will you have our prayer today? I will be in my knees. I will fold my hands. I will bow my head. I will close my eyes. Help us to do our best. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Boys and girls. Oh, that's Mr. Rooster. That's all the time we have for now. We're so happy you've joined us. And until next time, boys and girls, remember, Jesus loves you. Amen.